Hello, you guys. My name is Christine, and I'm back with another mukbang. This is gonna be super special because I'm featuring man-eating plant. They're really good friends of mine. Candice, she's my best friend, and we're gonna have dinner. Man, where do I start? So today they are having a pop-up and it's featuring, um, it's like a Japanese inspired theme. They had at their supper club, maybe like, I think it was like 2019, last year, yes, 2019. And it was like so freaking bomb. And um, it's on special today and I'm super excited to try it out again. So I have a dipping ramen. Um, the broth is like this toasted seeded broth. We got our uh, lion's mane. It's seared, nori, noodles. We also have squash blossoms and it's filled with spicy cashew cheese. We got dipping sauce and their classic, the crispy oyster mushroom bao. Mm, I'm so excited, so freaking excited. Okay, so where to start? Okay, let, well, let's go try a squash blossom. Mm. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Was it stuffed before? Mm -hmm. No, it wasn't stuffed. I think that's new. Mmm, it's so freaking good. Mmm. Oh. Bomb. Bomb. They always make delicious foods. Mmm. They always have pop ups in Long Beach. So I definitely recommend following them. Man eating plant LA. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Mm. <laughs> okay. They're bao buns, it's steamed in lotus. Beer battered crispy king oyster mushroom. They make their own hoisin sauce. It's cashew based. Their um, chili oil, cilantro, and other veggies. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. The lion's man. <laughs> Gonna add some lime onto the ramen. I know. So dipping ramen. I've never heard of that until I went to um, one of their supper clubs. And so it's basically all the broth in the bowl, noodles, and then you dip it. You know, usually the ramen is inside the bowl, but nope, it's different. You dip it. If, if I have things in my mouth, in my teeth, it's all good, okay? We're eating, we're eating good. I want to show you guys my dip, so when I dip, you dip, we dip. <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to put this in my mouth. Okay, so I'm not going to go from down. Actually, I am. Hmm. <sighs> Mmm. 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 So good. Oh my gosh, I forgot how this tasted like. Mmm. Wow. Phenomenal. Mmm. Mmm. 
this, babe. <laughs> oh. mm. Wow, I want to do it again. Okay. Mm. Mm. Oh my gosh, this squash blossom with this spicy cashew cheese is so freaking good. <laughs> yes. Oh. You can have one lion's mane and I'll have one lion's mane, babe. Mm. Wow. Again. <laughs> mm, my God. Look how creamy that is. And so flavorful. Mm. I'm so honored to be eating man-eating plant. Mm. 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 Now we're going to take another bite of this. Mm. <laughs> so good, so good. Mm. <sighs> I should drink some water. Mm. Got my alkaline life force water. So me and Anthony, we met Candice and Phil back in 2018. Um, so we started Veggie Fam. We, we have a vegan pop-up um, in 2018 and we sell a uh, vegan fried chicken sandwiches. And now we sell it online on, at GTFO, it's vegan. But before when we were doing pop-ups, uh, we were doing a vegan exchange in North Hollywood and that is where we met Candace and Phil of Man Eating Plant. Um, we've always vibed with them. Like they're just freaking dope. Two dope ass individuals, souls, you know? Um, seen them every week. And then also at different pop-ups. And then in 2019, um, me and Candice, we started getting really close. And I'm just so grateful for her. I'm so grateful for her existence. I'm so grateful for Man Eating Plant. I'm so grateful for joining the vegan community and being able to meet all these cool people, you know? And if it wasn't for us popping up, I wouldn't have met them. I probably would have ate, them, ate their food, but... You know, I'm just so, I'm so grateful for having them in our lives. And the best thing is that we live close to each other now. <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, I felt like when we went to Portland together last year was when we got like really close, you know. Um, it was both of our first times traveling out of state with our business and it was just so cool to be able to like squat up together and <clears throat> excuse me squat up together and pop up together and just make that moolah while sharing to the community our creations so yeah very blessed mm. Mm. oh so divine I wish I had more of the squash blossoms to eat it with the ramen. Toasted seeded broth. Mm. Wow, you guys. They also have another um, menu item that's one of their classics. It's called the chili garlic noodles. That's also so freaking fire. 
Can I have a bite of your thing, babe? Yeah, go ahead. I know, but thank you. You have some stuff on the right side of your face. I know. I'm eating though, so it's okay. Mm. That was so good. So earlier today, me and Anthony, we worked and we ate like this little snack, a croissant sandwich, and we've been waiting for our dinner. We were waiting for man eating plant. And it's so worth it. I made sure to be like extra hungry so that I could have so much room to eat. Mmm. Oh, they also had another um, special called the kombucha bowl. It's gluten free. And I was supposed to eat it yesterday, but I didn't get to. And um, they were offering it today, but I already got a lot of food. Oh, also after we eat dinner, we're going to be having dessert. There's this uh, vegan dessert spot um, on Orange and 7th Street in Long Beach. They were right next to a man-eating plants pop-up. And we got macaroons, vegan macaroons. I've never had that ever in my life, um, vegan, excuse me. And I missed macaroons, you know? So we got that, we got cookies, and we got a tart. So we're gonna just like eat that after dinner. But back to back to dinner. Mm. So good. Mm. Is this the one they made without garlic? I'm not sure. I didn't request it to be without garlic. I'm so good. I know. Pickles. I need a bit of better. Oh yeah. Mm. Mm. We got my cat Astro in the back. I don't know if you see him. Mm. But he always got my back. <laughs> Seared lion's mane, packed with so many benefits. Mm. I think I have broth on my glasses. All good. <laughs> mm. Don't mind me my chopstick skills. I just learned how to use chopsticks a few years ago. Mm. So good oh my goodness like I wish I had leftovers for tomorrow tomorrow is 12 12 portal mm. like to interchange with my foods if you didn't realize. Mm. <laughs> mm. I wish I had more squash blossom. That was so good. 
we had it before, but it wasn't stuffed. And this time it was stuffed with spicy cashew cheese and artichoke. It like really leveled it up. Mm. 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 Gonna squeeze our extra juice, mix it all around. Oh, I didn't realize I have mismatching chopsticks. <laughs> Do you want me to save you some ramen, babe? Yes? Okay. I honestly am so in love with the broth. My goodness, they're going to have a food bus um, very soon. Mm. And you'll be seeing them weekly. And you guys can try it out. Amazing vegan food. Oh, hands down. Look at that delicious, creamy broth just like dipped in there. Oh, was that a cheesecake? One of the things that I, you know, I've had so many different vegan ramens and it's always been a hit or miss for me. What happened to the nose, babe? Oh, it fell. What <laughs> it fell. Oh. What, the macaroon small? Mm. Thank you, babe. Nice, babe. Probably gonna be back, <laughs> but yeah. What I was, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So like the broth would be super watery, like just watered down broth, and that's not. I guess for me, my preference is I don't like watery broth. I like creamy broth, like this one. It's like so creamy and like to me, it tastes nutty. But there's seeds. It's like toasted, seeded broth, and it's just it hits it's so like good. It's like a curry. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm. It's called um tsukmin. I hope I didn't butcher that, but tsukmin. Oh. I'm so excited for their supper series to be back on. Mm. You want the rest of the broth? You want my bowel? But you still want the ramen? Okay. All right, I'm almost gonna wrap up because me and Anthony were sharing food. Mmm. Mmm. Where are we gonna eat next? Mmm. Mmm. Comment of your favorite vegan restaurant. Yeah, what's your favorite vegan restaurant? You know what would be amazing? Well, me and Anthony, we've been talking about it for a while now, and we really want to um, travel and pop up. I think we're gonna start popping up again. Mm. Maybe this month or next month. Mm. We miss cooking for you guys. Can you get me a napkin, please, baby? Mm -hmm. um, our OG hot fried chicken sandwich, which is like a Nashville. Our cheesy waffle fries. We make our own chicken, by the way. It's house made chicken. We make all our sauces. Mm -hmm. And um, our cheesy waffle fries. We make the cheese. It's like so freaking good. That's like, that's a classic of Veggie Fam. Mm. Ooh, I'm gonna dip it in here. Let's try it out. Let's try. Mm. So good. I have really good hoisin sauce. 
So I'm gonna wrap up really soon because the camera's gonna run out of, is it memory? Memory. Mm. Mm. This sauce is so good. Mm. Mm. This is gonna be my last bite and then the rest is gonna be for Anthony. I wish I had more noodles. Oh. Mm. I still have dessert. Mm. You want it, babe? Yeah. <laughs> all right so next up is dessert i thought i was gonna be done but well i only have a few minutes left so <sighs> mm. i know i wanted another bite but it's okay okay so i got a tart let me open it up I didn't ask her any questions. I was just like super excited uh. to get it. Um, it looks like what are, is it? What are these cranberries? Oh, cranberries. Yeah. Cranberries. It's a tart. I don't think I've ever had a tart like when I wasn't vegan. I don't remember. But let's try it out. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, there's filling in there. <gasps> oh my goodness. It tastes like something. You know those cookies? Are they like shortbread cookies? Do you know what I'm talking about, babe? No. I used to like eat them. Mmm. Gingerbread cookies? Mm-mm. I don't remember. Mm. That was good. I also got a holiday chocolate chip cookie. Mm. I already ate some. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Oat milk would be so good with this. Mmm. <laughs> and dun -dun -dun -dun. macarons or macaroons snowman edition mm. this is vanilla mm. i almost forgot how macaroons tasted like mm. Oh, hey, Oreo. Mmm, <laughs> this is so good. This is like the perfect night. So after this, I'm going to do a self-love bath. And then me and Anthony will probably do like a mini kundalini session and journal, read a book, pull some cards, chill with the cats, go with the flow. <laughs> mm. 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 
still mind the food in my mouth or my teeth. But thank you so much. It was super fun eating with you guys and sharing Man Eating Plant LA's food. Don't forget to follow them on Instagram. Yeah, that was amazing. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also follow me on Instagram at Ducky143.